Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to Dishonored. As you could tell from the title of the previous video, my phone is being a cunt and cut out the recording. I have erased a lot of data because of file size errors, so hopefully I'll be able to record some more and get them posted. And, you know, I need to get an SD card soon for this. Uh, but where the last one left off, I do believe, uh, you saw me collect some hemlock essence and speak about the mother who poisoned herself here. Well, now we are outside of Dr. Galvani's labs, which is part of the main mission. So, without further ado, now that we should be able to continue... First, I'm going to be smart. I'm going to save. This is a habit that I have to get into. I need to save every time that I start and end a video. Okay. To Dr. Galvani's labs. If you heard that, but I just popped my neck. Here we are. Well, that wasn't supposed to happen. That was supposed to be an assassination so that I could grab him and move him. Just as effective, though. Closing the door. Feeding log. Ah, uh, yeah, this is basically him talking about feeding his rats until an incident happened where one of his maids got killed by the rats. I'm trying to get him to come in that way. I can get in here without the rats bothering me. Pay no attention to the screams I'm sure you're going to hear in a moment. <laughs> it's always so amusing to know that guards are getting eaten alive by rats. If you manage to escape the rats... <laughs> okay, I need to get out of here before the rats finish eating and then kill me. Actually, I could literally just seal them in there. There we go. Crisis averted. can't leave witnesses. <sighs> I 
I can't leave witnesses. I know I'm wearing a mask, but I can't let people know that somebody's been here. Other than, you know, the trail of bodies. Oh, it's slack ja. It's slack ja. Hmm, good to know that I've ruined that. There's usually somebody that spawns up here, a couple of people and stuff. Galvani's Journal, let's see. Uh, 28th day, 7th month, 287. Remember that, guys, 287. I'm counting on you guys. You better not forget it, 287. Number guys, yeah, I can't remember. Speak up. Okay. Uh huh. You sure? Seven. Okie dokie. Thank you guys for remembering that. I appreciate it. My memory is shit. There's a map. Some bread. A painting of the great Lord Regent. Just smack him in the face. Maybe I was off the floor, it's possible. Nope. <sighs> it's like early in the morning here. I'm trying to record because I won't have any time tomorrow and then I'm gonna be gone. You guys wouldn't have forgiven me for missing that. Okay. If you guys see anything that I'm missing and can pick up, please shout. Oh, thanks. The latest case should arrive within a week. Yada yada. Containing the components you need. Be careful with the white phosphorus. Can't have you getting fossy jaw like the tanners at the edge of the city. Poor bastards. So, you know what? You know, sorry, I have to practice in secret. The vivisectionists should be celebrated. Revered, even. Cutting up her act should be done in the town square with a crowd of eager students taking notes. Not in some dirty little secret room hidden behind a wall of books. That wall of books specifically. Okay, I can't read that now. Anyway, yeah. Oh, also, if you look at this, it tells you how you how to defeat river crusts, which I already know. Uh, you just you, you can't shoot the other shell. Hmm. One of these things is not like the other. Yes, that is a fetus. They are not complete. Coriander zoological It's a bull rat fetus. It's as large as a normal rat. Which means, plague rats have only been here for which means bull rats are the size of a fucking dog. Would they have been introduced on purpose? Perhaps by a foreign power. Like seriously, look at the size of that thing. That's a fetus. <laughs> hmm. 
Am nam nam. Actually, I should leave that open. It'll make it easier on the net. Yeah, fuck it. I'm not going stealth. Okay. So I have that. Distillery District. Uh, that says the same thing as it said in the last one. I'm not going to reread it. in the last video, uh, we freed Griff, and I have no clue where the video cut out, but basically I just ran up here, I collected a whole bunch of fucking loot from up here, I came up here and was like, huh? And then I was like, oh yeah, you guys are gonna get mad if I don't inspect this, because it's glowing, but it's just a bit of particle. And then I ran over here, and this is where the mother poisoned herself. She was sitting right here crumpled, and I was like, oh, you're supposed to be sitting in the chair, lady. And, you know, these are her two children and her husband, and then there's the Book of Child Rhymes, and there's Hemlock Essence here that I collected, and then there's her diary. But enough of that. I'm going to go poison the Bottle Street Gang and slaughter them. Old Dunwall Distillery. Now these guys are actually extremely dangerous and hard to kill. This is one odd bird. Consorts with crazies, does rituals and the like, bone charts and such. You sound afraid. Damn right I am. Hmm. Touch my outside. Drop powers. Well then, you know Stealth is always your greatest ally, even when you're killing people. Especially when you're killing people. What the fuck am I saying? Oh shit, you weren't supposed to finish. I don't want to take these guys on in a fight. For several reasons. And yes, I just hit that. Oh shit. That sounded close. Oh shit, yeah, I would have been caught. Oh, the rust is coming off, guys. I am... No, I need to loot that. Bastards. Okay, I took the pouch. I'm good. What was that? Oh, no, 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 no. You're not supposed to... Where are you? He's gone. Okay. Now that he's down, we can push forward. And just in case of a fuck up, I'm gonna save right quick. Okay, game saved. Hmm. Let's see. Face like a hagfish, yeah. Okay, so there's those two down there. I could bait him over here and then take care of him. What was that? You heard something? 
Or maybe you're hallucinating. Well, didn't want to get into a fight. Looks like I am. Ah, oh, shit, that's why. Here you are. Okay. Actually, perfect demonstration for the spring trap. It didn't even hit them. Basically, the spring razor. Jesus, the spring razor basically once a, once attached to something, uh, basically just twirls out extremely fucking fast, and um, cuts things to itty bitty pieces. Rewire tools are useful for alarms. Other than that, you can rewire walls of light and cause them to burn guards instead of you. They don't even see it coming either. Just one second they're there, and then the next, without any cause, they're just their life has been ended. Oh no, whatever shall I do? Should I turn that? Oh! Fuck you. Played this game way too much. Okay, I'm full on bullets. Okay, here's another spring razor. I'll show you guys what he does. Grenade. Like, I will find somebody and show you what it does. It's one of my favorite weapons, even though it's not really a weapon but a defensive tool. That was just a recipe talking about how they're the stuff they distill is mostly water. Yeah, the chain's awkward because if you look down, pushing down will make you go up and vice versa. I can never remember if that guy's alone down there. That's a nice level right now. Okay, I got one for you. Well, give it. Okay, here goes. The nobleman laid with the scullery. So loudly they made quite a riot. The nobleman's wife is a footman. Carve yourself a piece of blood. Stealth. It's useful. Okay, I got quiet there and I really didn't intend to, guys. I apologize. I was just concentrating. But I got him. It's kind of letting you listen to those rhymes. I don't know if you could hear them. Okay, so there should only be those two guys up there. And I already know who I'm going to use the spring. Are there spring razor on or whatever. Got anything to smoke or eat? Shut up. Who's that? Someone's bringing me my dinner. Oh, well, fuck. They're on to me. I totally forgot about these bone charms and stuff. Throw Someone's the... about to get shanked. <laughs> yeah, and it's you. Okay, keep banging. Must have been rats. Damn it, what now? Huh, I know something's up. Ah! Yeah! 
Well, oh shit. Oh shit, where'd you come from? I heard him, but I was looking for him. Oh, that hurt like a bitch. Well, I'll go ahead and show you what the spring razor does. That never gets old. You can even carry his legs around. Just, just, just look, just look at that beautiful. See a bit of his spine right there. Carry it around, throw it somewhere. Man, whew. when he became a thug, he really became half the man he used to be. <laughs> okay, what's this bone charm? Whirlwind. You swing your sword slightly faster. And before I poison it, I'm going to get some. How many can I hold? Okay, I have full of it. Okay. And now I'm going to infect it. Hey, look, another one. Money! You can never have too much money in this game. Like, there never really comes a point where you're like, I have too much money in this game. Oh yeah, you could all... You can also get to the point where you can summon swarms of rats. Which is actually a very useful ability, especially in mid-combat. This is why I don't. But I fucked up. Ah, oh, God. I'll be right back. Okay. So that took like 30 seconds. And I'm right back to where I was. Unfortunately, he didn't see me, so he's not here. What I had intended to do was to drop on him and get the assassination, spin around, whip out the pistol, and headshot the other one, and then I would have been set. But as you could tell, I kind of fucked up. That went much better. Rule one of the School of John. Never leave a survivor. Not even one to tell the tale. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm pausing the video whenever I get to a loading screen. That way you guys don't have to sit through the loading screen. Yeah. You're welcome. How many YouTubers do that for you? How many? 
well, basically I do Wart, Markiplier, Vanoss, H2O Deliri, a lot of them actually do, unless they're talking. Hi, Granny. I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Now I can stroll along the waterfront in peace. And don't think I've forgotten your little gift. Go on upstairs, dear one. One second, I'm going to change something. <laughs> there we are. Isn't that much better now? Larger image. Sorry about that, guys. Thank you, Granny. And now I should be able to upgrade Blink. Okay. So now I have all of my mobility. I am literally a ninja. See, now I can blink much farther. Before, I would have only been able to blink there. Almost double the range. Now we can push forward with the mission. Oh shit. Well. <laughs> Fuck it, balls to the wall. Cold as a whaler's gaffe. Fifty years old at least. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna let you guys have a treat. Forget his old hat. I can't even remember the gift. We tagged it plain. Under Clavern Street is our. Come on. What's the take? Twenty. Plus two elixir. Look like twenty-five to me. Look here. It's twenty. It's five each, counting blue. You want me to check your pockets? Let it go, kid. Don't call me kid. You think you can cheat me? Come on, let's get this on. Let's see what's inside. That's why I never take them on head on. Oh, he's holding out a lot longer than he usually does. I usually play on the hardest difficulty. Oh, there it goes. Well, he said he had 20 on him. Let's find out just how much he had. How much do you have? He had 5. He didn't even have any on him. Oh, he did. Oh, 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 he had 25. He was... Ah, oh, this guy was right. The other guy was an asshole who was stealing. <laughs> so, yeah, that's a little treat. If you leave those guys alone, that happens. Confiscated rune. We found this rune. We found this strange rune, rune on the woman who used to sell pastries up the street. Not sure how she died, 
but since things look superstitious, we're set. We set it aside for the overseers. After your shift is over, take it to them for disposal or whatever it is they do with it. Don't forget. So, see, we've already gotten three runes in one mission. I don't even know if there's another dart out here. Well, I know what that sound means. <laughs> they give you a little sound cue, like violins are slowly raising in volume whenever rats are nearby. Hi, friend! Loading screen! Okay, the reason I stopped reading the text here is because it says the same thing as it said the entire time, and it will once you enter a mission. It doesn't change very often. But here we are. Now the thing about overseers, like this one here, they have a mask that will protect them from headshots from the front. The second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. Is that true? Or is it the itching that really gets you? Or the rats? Jasper, isn't it? That's not so bad in here. Except I miss your wife. That burn. Ha! Huh. You that don't burn. scare easy, I'll give you that. That'll change. Go ahead, turn around. Huh? Don't scare easy, huh? <laughs> you may not scare easy, but your last moments were full of fear. Hello, Martin. What a sight you are. <sighs> Feels good to stand up straight. Thank you. Cool. What you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance. We've got to find Emily. So kill Campbell and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal. His notorious black book. And get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kerner. And word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. Now, there are if several ways Samuel that you can handle this. You One of my personal favorites is swapping the poison and just letting Campbell drink his own poison and die. But I'm going to show you guys what I call justice. For him betraying the Empire and setting me up for the fall. For him being part of it, I should say. It's a rare occurrence, but I did spy the face of one so far. Before the Vampire Horde. How was I seen? Someone get over here. I know you're here somewhere, scum. I'll feed your heart to the hounds. Get behind here. Die, idiot. Oh, that's a grenade. Oh, that's a grenade. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Get going down. Oh. Ah, shit. <laughs> I know that was a dick move. I shot him in the knee. I used to be an overseer like you until some prick shot me in the knee. Okay. So first things first. Yes, yes, alternate pathways. Okay, I was considering it, but he was up against a cabinet, so I don't think it would have worked. Uh, occasionally, when you headshot an enemy with a bolt, it will take their head completely off and pin it to a wall. You know, fucking amazing. Huh. 
Also, I'm going to show you guys something else. Keep an eye on that grate. I'm going to show you guys something. Okay. So this grate here. Watch this. This is something that I found out that they really didn't intend to be in the game, I don't think. But it is. You see, this is just one of the many ways you can go in. And once you're under here, this guy spawns in. He literally just spawned in. You can pickpocket him. However, he's not there. Unless he sprinted off just for no fucking reason. He just stood there for a... Just, just stood over the grate to light a cigarette. You heard the lighter flick. And then he just walks away. But the thing is... But no! Ah, damn it, that's what the update was. You used to be able to come down here and he was still here. And you could just go back and forth and it, he just fucking appeared and disappeared and it was hilarious. Anyway. Now, for what I'm going to do, I do need to be stealthy. So I cannot be detected to deliver justice. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go inside, clear out all the overseers, and before I trigger the main sequence, I'm going to come out here and kill all the guards. Well, there is a couple of ways that I can prevent. Oh, yeah. It actually just occurred to me. That's... Yeah. <laughs> I, di I didn't go in there. I'm smart. Got wrong button. I'm smart. Okay. I know where all the rooms and shit are, so I'm not even worried about that. Actually, I enjoy playing with the bodies. I really do. Oh, nope, it costs two. I, I, I have to get Shadow Kill. It will make things so much easier for me. Basically what Shadow Kill does is once you kill somebody, their body turns to ash. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search the place top to bottom. And nothing to eat but the swim. I'm gonna save right quick, guys. I'm gonna be right back. Okay, and we're back. Now, this is the most important part of what I call justice. The Heretic brand is reserved for those overseers who have committed heinous acts against the Order, but have not broken codes that would otherwise result in execution. No contact, aid, or shelter can be given to those wearing the brand. That person is forevermore unwelcome to the Abbey and its affiliates. When used, the brand is applied to the forehead so all can see the sins of the recipient. 
the chemical compound acts immediately, scarring the heretic for the remainder of life. The interrogation room here at the office of the High Overseer stands ready for branding. And what do we have here? But the brand of the heretic. <laughs> you can all already see where I'm going. This isn't a pacifist route. I fully intend on branding him a heretic and then killing him. See, once someone is branded a heretic, they are no longer a citizen of Dunwall. It was Martin's plot to murdering them. That's clear it, it's not smiled but upon, Martin, nor is it frowned upon. The Empire. He's as bloody minded as they say, left a trail of bodies, and the way he dodged the axe, we can't rule out black magic. He had help, yes, but how far <laughs> does it go? The trail goes uh, you're too correct. Oh, well, I fucked that up. This is what I refer to as a dump. This is where I dump most of the bodies because it won't be found. And if I'm correct, there's one more. Unless that was the one that I... Nope, he's here somewhere. see with dark vision I would be able to see them but I already know where most of them are and where they spawn this is one of the first I haven't played in a long time so he turned around now the reason that I'm hiding the bodies even in the secluded library is because if they're discovered they will sound the alarm, and that will ruin what I have in store. There we are. Okay. I have to be extremely cautious because sometimes there's four or five guards in the hallway. And now the alarm will not sound. Even if I am caught here, I am perfectly safe. This is where things can get dangerous. Sorry, 
I'm pressing and holding X to carry, but I think I'm pressing it too soon because it's not taking effect. I know that only scripted NPCs come down here, so... Yeah, because that's totally hidden. Get the recording still going. Turn that music off. I was correct. Remember in the uh, first, the first episode? I was correct. The cider is gone. And now I no longer have to worry about hiding bodies. As long as they are unaware of me, when I strike them, well... <laughs> Shadow kill. Curse those fools in Coleridge for letting Corvo get away. Who knows what the man could do now? Hi. Hello, the Lord Regent, as he asks us to call him now, seems to have faith in all the Sokolov security devices he's put up all over the city, but I'm not so sure. At least the girl has been moved to a safe place. Visiting her twice a week has given me ample opportunity to inspect the facilities, as they say. So there's an upside, at least. Now with Shadow Kill, I no longer have to worry about uh, the bodies being found, as long as it's an unsuspecting kill. These guys will probably be the last to die, because it's almost impossible to get them without being detected. But yes, you will soon see what Shadow Kill is. There's a reason I'm not sprinting, because heavy footsteps will alert enemies. No mess. No hassle. I'm sure the janitors appreciate it. Okay, now with that out of the way, I can go outside and deal with them. So yeah, this, this is the window that I was looking through a moment ago. You can see how well these levels were designed and thought out. Just The people who made this game were just absolutely amazing at what they do. Now this alarm cannot be sounded. pretty much safe. I should also be able to get ample upgrades. Sorry, hangnail. What will we do with a drunken whaler? What will we do with a drunken whaler? What will we do with a drunken whaler? Early in the morning. Cut his belly with a rusty razor. Cut his belly with a rusty razor. 
cut his belly with a rusty razor. Early in the morning. He asked me to reveal myself. That should be everyone, other than the people in the basement and Campbell's personal guards. Huh? Oh, hi, friend. I literally forgot about you. Come on. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. I completely forgot about that method. That was just muscle memory. That, that's how much I've played this game. Actually, I, I do need to... Oh! Thank you, lower guard. You made me remember. The kennels. Let your keen eyes wander tonight, boy. There's word bad men about. Here's a good boy. I do not condone nor approve the murder of animals. Good boy, Justice. I'm surprised that headshot wasn't a kill. This puzzle always fucking gets me. He looks up to see a strange man across the hall. And before he realizes, his life has been taken. Yeah, I really don't care about the bodies being left here. That's that's the only reason I'm not really giving a fuck. Well, that was... That was useful. This is a sick pup. Almost deathly sick. He's fallen ill, and he's gone to fetch some medicine for the hound... It wouldn't be a true kill all route if I don't kill him. He's he's very ill at the moment. He's in a lot of pain. I'm not even actually I'm not even rationalizing this. He's literally like in a lot of pain. He has a uh, fuck what was it? Oh shit. He has diseases. I do not condone nor approve the killing of animals for any reason. Oh wait, yeah. Plus I have to get in here and he would attack me and I'd have to kill him anyway. Oh, wait. I may not have had to come in here. Okay, I'm going to take a moment to save since, you know, we're almost an hour in. And we're saved. But there is... May have actually been in this one. Why didn't you guys shout? Seriously. The seven strictures, wandering gaze, lying tongue. Okay, so that's in my notes, so I'll be able to access that. That's part of the puzzle that's fucking annoying. I never bothered to memorize it, because I hardly ever come down here, but... Oh, okay.
Oh, Jesus. Oh. Oh. <laughs> A little jump scare for you guys. That's... I'm not the only one who's been visiting. I guess that's kind of just... This dog was like... Phasing through the bars like... You shall pay for what you have done. Okay. Tongue gaze mind. Tongue gaze mind. Uh, mm. Oh, Jesus. Ugh. Well, I guess I have to go back and read it. Tongue gaze mind. 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 Two one seven. Okay. It's always beneficial to solve these puzzles. Because you always get good stuff from it. Okay then. Okay, yep. And we're back. And now we can continue with the plan. Overseer's curse. I feel like I'm forgetting. No, I'm not. Fucking knew it. Always trust your instincts. If you think you've remembered everything, you fucking forgot something. Ah, shit, we're almost an hour in. Well, I'm going to try to do these episodes by the mission, more than anything, when my, you know, phone's not being a cunt. So, yes. I trust you. She's having trouble holding the side strings. Bunch of children playing games, that's all. Oh, good. And your niece, Callista. See, you could you you can swap the poison, poison both, or spill the poison. Spilling the poison causes them to go down to the basement, where you can save uh, the guard captain. Yeah, and that means that they're about to come in, but I still have a moment. Servants must have been in here. Let me see. Like and that nobody one. should be in the courtyard. Ah, here we are. Good. Sure. 
doing a quick double check to make sure the path's clear. What a who's been in here? I owe you an apology, Captain. This is hardly the hospitality. Well, time to do this the hard way. What was that, Campbell? Never mind. It's a now, I'm supposed you. to save her I'm now, but, uh, real you all know how this is going to happen. We'll share with all of them. <laughs> Very well, Campbell. As long as we get this little dispute settled. They already drew their swords. They shouldn't have... No, they're completely unaware. They have to be. Yeah, they're unaware. Okay. I'm not sure why they drew their blades, but... Oh shit, the body. When I left this place and entered the the uh, kennels, it caused everything to reset, body-wise. You like trading? I've got an early struggle around here somewhere. I prefer the early work. Something primal in there, the way the brushwork slashes across the canvas. Where's it gone? Uh, check behind those crates. William? I don't see it. Never had much time for art myself. You have my thanks. Though by all rights, I should probably arrest you. You seem familiar, even with that mask on. <laughs> Oh. Oh. It did it. And of course, he's only unconscious. Keep that in mind. For now. Actually, just because I'm sure some of you all want to hear. That is actually a reference to the Knife of Dunwall DLC before it was made, which you will eventually see. I will try to uh, reference that. I will try to make a note to reference that. This episode's going to go on for a lot longer than I intended. See, if my recording hadn't have fucked up, I would have just... Mm. I would have simply broke this into two hour long parts. But my thing fucked up. Okay, Campbell's going to rest there for a minute. I have some business to deal with. There's your crack. They've respawned. Interesting. Oh no, these are the guys that run there. 
There you go. You don't have to do it any longer. Okay, so those were the guys that were in the... Yeah. Those are the guys that were in here. Which means there's probably two more running around somewhere. I'll have to make a more thorough sweep. See, because I'm leaving no survivors, just people are basically going to think, I mean, this isn't really what they're going to think in game, but it's basically going to seem to some people that just all of a sudden, overseers were just disappeared. And then as time passes, the decaying bodies before I purchased the shadow kill upgrade will begin to decay and smell and be found. <laughs> Only then will they begin to realize what happened. There's probably another one around here somewhere. But for now, it is time for justice. He has been marked. Well, that didn't do what it was supposed to. Fuck! That should have been a more... That should have been a better execution. I should have just done a single crossbow bolt to the head. Fuck it! Who says I can't? I want it in the forehead, damn it. Fine, take it in the fucking mouth. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna be right... Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm unused to it. I kind of need the aim assist. Well, there you go. They're just going to find a crossbow bolt inside of him. And now, everyone downstairs... Hello? Now, interesting fact, I, I have no, no regret for killing these guys, but for good reason. If you take the heart out when you attack and they kneel, it talks about how each of them spy on their neighbors and report to the overseers and how they've beaten people before and stuff like that. And yes, I'm going to take all their money. And now I'm just going to walk out of the front. Everyone has been killed. Okay, except for that one guy on the grate. But I'm not going to count that because he's apparently a fucking wizard. I'm going to call him Marasmus. But wait, there's more.
Please. She's my sister. She's not a witch. I love her. Away. You expect preferential. Okay, I kind of acted on that without letting you guys know what was going on there. Basically, you come across these two overseers, and there's another overseer on the ground without a mask, and he's like, please, she's my sister, she's not a witch. And the other guy's like, you wish for preferential treatment, for you are an overseer, but you will not be spared because she is a witch, to which they proceed to kill him and his sister. Luckily, I was here to prevent that. <laughs> 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 Whether or not she's actually a witch, I have no fucking clue, but hey. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, I also feel no regret for slaughtering all these overseers because they literally kidnap children. That's where they get their overseers from. They kidnap children and brainwash them. intended on happening was I was just okay yeah cuz blood can climb walls that's not creepy um I was trying to uh, while he was staring at the wall I was gonna get up behind him and shoot him in the back of the head that's unprotected and try to pin his head to the wall but the cunt turned around also I'm not sure why used to be you could open that door and it was a whole separate load area but you could literally just climb over the top and <laughs> you could see it worked the shadow mark of his head is there I kind of forgot that I can't do that anymore. <laughs> but that's okay. Oh, this is a bitch. What? Oh, I totally forgot about that. Oh, yeah, this is a bitch. I'm just gonna... Yeah, that rat swarm life ain't for me, bruh. Another bone charm, let's see. Plague affinity, getting damaged by weepers gives you a small amount of mana. You guys haven't even seen a weeper yet. Well, first episode. But they were kind of in the void. I, I don't really... You'll see one next episode. I think what I'm going to do is once I get back to Samuel, I'm going to end the episode. What? Oh, is it the dog? Damn it! Someone's down! Don't relax just yet, Marines! I also plan on doing a full playthrough of Aliens vs. Predator. Now the next thing I'm going to show you, there's two ways of this happening. I'm going to let it go down and let you guys see it. No, it's just a little cough. Fine, I'm fine. Look at you. I feel good. You have lied. You were trying to conceal it from us. Was that your intent? To spread the malady to us? 
No, Frank. I, I tell you, I, I am well. <laughs> as fit as ever. Put down your weapons. Just think for a moment before you... He was sick. Very, very sick. <laughs> Oh shit! No! You will not fire that off and blow my cover. Okay. I share no mercy for those who will kill a comrade. It's very likely that he had the plague, but it's just as likely that he had a cold. Also, this dog? Fuck this dog. I lost like one HP. I needed to refill health, dude. I was, I was like, I was hurting for that HP. Okay, is it three? Okay, two or three? Yep. Went. Well, you were in the radius of that, but okay. Oh, okay, just a small amount of rats will only eat corpses, which is actually good for me. No bodies to be found. I need a little more spring razors. Which you, you can actually carry this all the way to where it needs to be, but fuck that shit. I know how to get there without it. This is an overseer's music box. When activated, magic is disabled. I don't like that shit. created a monster. We cannot doubt the effectiveness of Holger's device, or the mathematical beauty of the music itself. We've seen it in action against the forbidden practices too many times to deny it. But the question no one wishes to ask Oh yeah, I like this. I like this. I've seen those harnesses you've been devising in that workshop of yours. If you plan to strap explosives to my press of hounds and make living bombs out of them, you can count me out of your plan. I'm the master of the hounds here, and without my training, they'll never do as you request. Motherfucker wants to make fucking suicide hounds. I'm I'm gonna try not to make a uh, Walu Akbar joke. I, I seriously need to ref Okay, whatever. I was gonna do something, but I'm not. Get the fuck out of there, but that music is annoying. Oh, there's what I was looking for. Wait, was there... 
Oh, shit. expected okay anyway yeah you could take the wheel to the proper place but I found it much easier to just do this I managed to steal away one of the charms they were smashing in the warehouse I spoke smashing them such beautiful and powerful things that my brothers have no idea they'll never find me back here though nobody ever comes back here I can break up the door, they'll never find me, it's all mine. Okay, what bone charm were you holding on to? Drop assassinations give you a bit of mana. Fuck yeah. You guys know how often I drop assassinate. Thank you. As for you... Thief. I told him not to, I told him not to jump, I told him he wouldn't make it to the water. I mean, you gotta have black magic to reach the shit! Oh, Jesus, I almost just killed myself. Oh, yeah, I kinda forgot about the hagfish. Let's not. Isn't it a bit cold for a bath? From the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. You ready to go? Okay, let's go. Okay, guys. Let's take a look at those mission stats. I killed 60 hostiles. And out of that, I killed, uh, so called eight, killed eight civilians. They only found 13 bodies. I found all seven bone charms, all seven uh, runes, I found all the shrines, I found all the paintings, and I got 24,083 coins out of 37,094. Guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you want to. Every time that I see a comment or whatever, I don't care if it's an insult, my heart flutters because that means that I've entertained somebody. That, Like I've said. So, you know, you leave me some critique. Let me know what you thought. I will talk to you guys later.